Hi everyone, Marianne from MC Beaters. I am so, so sorry about the mess, but I have been painting. And um, this is my messy kitchen table where I paint. And I just wanted to show you guys what I've been up to. As you know, we're gonna have, me and Caroline are having a craft fair sometime in April. And I wanna get some new things um, to show and sell. So the project I am doing is wine bottle slash champagne bottles. Um, um, what are they called? Wind chimes. Sorry. Wind chimes. So I want to show you how I did them. I took a, um, this was actually a champagne bottle. It's pretty heavy. And I bought myself a glass cutter and I cut the bottom of the bottle and I see how thick it is I um, sandpapered the bottom and then I had some stencils that I found in my um, where my paints are and I stenciled some fairies mushroom fairy and like a little, I guess that's where they lived, a little, I don't know, a little house or something, a door. So that's one. And here's another. This one only has the two mushrooms. I tried to change it up a little bit. Okay. And then I have in yellow. I also, when they're dried about an hour, I bake them. Oh, this one, wait, that one's, oh yeah, this one I just made today. I changed it up. Okay, she's pink. And some green mushrooms. And she's pink on the bottom. And here's another, same thing. All the way around, <laughs> excuse me. And here is um, dragonflies. Dragonflies and these bottles, these are better. These are light. I don't know if you could see them. Um, actually, I should have a white background. Let me, let me stand up. Hold on. Sorry. Okay, here's the white background. Okay. Whoop. Sun. Oh, geez. Sun glaring. All right. This one's different. This one has, I put grass on the bottom and I have three dragonflies and I did the same with the second one just I placed them in different spots and I tried to use like springy colors the greens are different the green grass and then I kind of did almost like a neon green final um, um, wind chime is going to look like this I have a cork that I purchased from my AC Moore and those um, screws that have the, I don't know what they're called, eye hooks, I guess, and a chain. So I put an eye hook on the top, an eye hook on the underneath. I hung a chain from the top. I E6000 the inside of the rim of the bottle. And then I strung pearls. I mean, uh, beads, all different beads. I'm gonna put it in the light, hold on. Okay, and so you can see that they're, it's strung with really um, heavy duty string, it's black string. And then inside are all of my pearl um, beads. And the bottom, I purchased a big washer from Lowe's and I E6000 gems on them. So that's actually the thing that's making the noise. And then I added more beads to the bottom. And then I painted, oh gosh, I wish it would stop moving. Hold on, yes. I painted, I had, this was a piece of wood that I got in the wood section of Michael's. And I just painted it. And then I did the same thing on the bottom. I have um, the dragonfly. I'm sorry, I'm doing this one-handed. Um, so that's the final piece. And it sounds really pretty. Let me bring it. See? 
hopefully they like it. I'm thinking, you know, at a winery, a wine bottle. I don't know, trying to change it up a little bit. Okay, and that's all for today. Bye-bye.